Not too sure what it is yet. Oh, oh yeah. I was hoping I'd find one today. Now I don't want it to play dead. Because I want you guys to see how cool the snake is. So as you can see, it's hissing. It's curling its tail up and it is flattening out its kind of neck area it looks a lot like a cobra but what a cool snake so i'm really happy to see this guy What a beauty. What a gorgeous snake. <laughs> I hope you guys think so too. Even though it could look pretty frightening seeing that neck looking a lot like a cobra, but so we're just going to escort the snake across the trail in the direction it's going. But how cool. It's like a little North American mildly venomous cobra. I'll hood it up. I want to also note that uh, you can kind of see why these guys are mistaked for rattlesnakes a lot. Just because they have that similar pattern, similar coloration too. Um, these guys are mildly venomous, so uh, they're no threat to humans at all. Perfectly safe to handle and everything. But these are one of my favorite snakes. Just because <laughs> just everything about them is just so cool. But yeah, this is the Eastern Hog. Eastern Hog no snake. So glad I came out today. So glad I wound up over here. I didn't plan on coming over here. It's kind of a place I've never been to before, so. Now this isn't that legendary orange Fowler's Toad have found, but this guy's bright red. This is why I like looking at these toads, because they could be so many different colors. This guy's a deep red. So cool. Awesome colors. Beautiful colors. Just passed by that racer. Oh, it hopped up on a tree. Oh. This guy is fast. Look at that. How cool. Hi, buddy. This guy just made his way into a tree. I hope I zoomed in on his face. Can't really see. But this black racer, I walked past them. Anyway, I walked past this black racer and didn't see him. And then I noticed him and he ran up into this tree. There's his face. 
<laughs> Pretty snake though. Better look at those scales. Right, let's see what else is out here. Leave this guy alone. I'm just going to pour some unchlorinated water on them, in case. That's how you know he's a male. Cool. His eyes just look cloudy in the camera, but they're not. This guy's cool though. This guy's got a nice pattern. I'm gonna let this guy go. I'm back in my yard somewhere. I guess. Don't go back in the pool, buddy. Just after I took that video of the pickerel frog. Down this fowler's toad. So I'm at the same spot that I was at yesterday since it seems like it should be a good spot. So we'll see what else is out here. Here's the first herp of the day. This really tan looking fowler's toad. Here's another fowler's toad. Where is it? Here's another fowler's toad. These guys are hognose food, because hognoses are toad specialists. They love toads. So hopefully this is a good sign. I totally forgot. It is wild cranberry season. So there are tons of cranberries growing all around here. Look at this little guy. Hatchling fence lizard. Got nice orange on the tail. So cute. What an adorable lizard. Okay, I'm gonna put this little guy back. There he goes. So I just stopped on my way home for this little common snapper. Don't worry, he's alive. He didn't get hit or anything. Good thing I saw this guy. Now that this guy's out of his shell, get a better look at him. His claws are digging into my hand a little bit. What a cute turtle. Alright, so I don't know if you guys could see that. Still got that egg tooth. So, this guy is a very young hatchling. Spotted this fence lizard on the side of the road. Hi, buddy. Well, I'd hate to be that guy. So, I had no luck for pretty much the whole day. It's a couple days later, and I decided to come out to the spot. I even checked out a power line cut and flipped a bunch, but didn't find anything. Except for a black racer, but it got away. Like, I noticed that at the last second. But, on my way out of here, noticed this gorgeous male. Box turtle. Eastern box turtle. Look at them eyes. And look at those colors. This guy is absolutely stunning. Yeah, this is absolutely one stunning male Eastern box turtle.
nice orange, nice red eyes. And here's a look at the carapace. Really cool. Very vibrant. So I'm going to let this guy be. And I hope he doesn't try to cross the road that's ahead of us. But yeah, cool. Uh, I also wanted to say while this guy's kind of making his way off the trail is that uh, these guys are highly sought after um, by people who collect wild animals and also people that poach turtles. So these guys are, I'm pretty sure, under special concern uh, in New Jersey. So don't want to uh, mess with this guy too much and just something to appreciate.